country under construction. Hastily, Indonesia tries to catch up. Building railways, bridges, roads. Lots of roads. There isn't much time to get it all done. Most Indonesian cities are already overcrowded. While the economy grows at high speed, goods are moving at a snail's pace. And people too. Jan has been a minibus driver for 15 years. While the economy booms, his income has fallen significantly. He hardly moves at all. They say they want to reduce the traffic jams. Let's wait and see. I don't see any proof of this yet. There's also a pressing need to build and expand airports. This promotional film shows what Jakarta's international airport could look like next year. It has a yearly capacity of 22 million passengers, but already handles more than 50 million. The government has yet to decide whether to build a bigger airport. It's been hampered by land issues and budget constraints. No, I think it's very hard to believe about it. Because number one, you know, where is the money that they try to invest? Because we don't have much in, uh, in our budget for invest, uh, especially the money for infrastructures, you know. This is what I can see because even the budget for subsidies is bigger than for infrastructures. Despite its economic success, Indonesia is forced to slow down. The country simply can't keep up with its own growth. And while investors are optimistic about Indonesia's potential, many are also complaining about increasing costs. The government says it hopes to increase the budget for infrastructure projects over the next few years, but it will also have to rely on private investors. There's never too little too late, yeah? The important, the important thing is if we can keep the momentum, yeah? That's very important, if we can, we can keep the momentum of our economic growth, of our economic development, of a more equitable development that we've just started, more inclusive development, including, yeah? the development of our infrastructure. The minister predicts it will take more than five years before Indonesia will see real movement. Until then, it will take a lot of patience to do business in this thriving nation that continues to crawl. Step Fasen, Al Jazeera, Jakarta.